Okay, short meals by Natasha. Basically, I have some fresh mushrooms that were previously frozen. Um, yeah, that were previously frozen. Um, some broccoli, a little bit of water at the bottom. I don't know if you can see, a little bit of water. And about a tablespoon of butter. So basically, I'm going to heat all this up and then drain the water off, season it, and while that's cooking, and which I'm actually going to add a lid to it, if I can find it, but uh, let that cook, excuse my ashy hands. Um, and then I have three potatoes that I'm going to wash and scrub. And let's see if I can find my little scrubber. This is something that I bought at Bed Bath & Beyond. You basically screw the lid off and you put the soap in the inside and you press a little button to squirt it. And you wash off the whatever you're trying to wash off. But I use this for actually potatoes. And I'm going to cook the potatoes in the microwave. I'll be back. Okay, so basically we're going to let that cook. And then I found that Velveeta has these cheese sauces. You know, sometimes you have things that you want a little bit, a little bit more extra cheese. And you don't feel like slicing those Velveeta cubes up. Guess what? They have Velveeta cheese sauce that comes in the packages, and you can it comes in a box of three. So, I think I'm pretty much I'll probably buy these again. And then I also have chicken that my honey already baked in the oven yesterday. Basically, I cook a lot of meat and then I use those in my meals for the following week. Just basically cook a whole bunch of meat and then decide from there what I'm going to do with it. So I'm going to actually, once this cooks down and everything defrosts, um, I'm going to add the Velveeta cheese. I'm also going to add tostitos salsa con queso and I'm also going to add some shredded cheese in there and also a little milk to make sure um, that everything is not too um, basically chunky and that it's smooth and creamy be back with you okay, okay. this is Ayana and she is washing the potatoes with the I guess you can call it a little scrubber in the sink and she's basically getting it clean so that we can eat it I don't like dirty potatoes okay ladies and gents right here I've already at the chicken and I've cut it up while it's in the pot and I'm basically be quiet and I'm letting it uh, cook up and heat up okay this is Skylin my other daughter she is stirring up the mixture and it's looking kind of thick so what I'm gonna have to do is more than likely add some milk to it to thin it out some okay so basically I'm gonna stab the potato on four sides two times I've already done the other two sides I did some right here and I did some right here. And I'm heating these potatoes up for about um, eight to maybe ten me uh, eight to ten minutes. See, this one's already done. See how the fork penetrated the potato very easily. Slit the potatoes Wait, open. What? I didn't start yet. Yes, you did. Why is your finger in the way? Oh. <laughs> Basically, I slit the potatoes. Basically fork in the potato and I'm going to add my mixture on top of the potato.